and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge, where in today's episode we shall be training, wait for it, Ace Arceus. Oh my gosh, they're gonna follow us around. This is so amazing. It's so big. Hi, can I? Can we? T can we talk? Can we just? Yeah, Ace is staring intently at the mountain. Something's happening at the mountain. But Mesper, uh, Rutana is staring at the mountain. Ace is staring at the mountain. Oh my gosh, I just, I can't even believe it. Um, let's take a quick look at Ace, God of Pokemon. Uh, oh, listen to that call. It's pretty good. I mean, it's not, it's not. <laughs> it's not a, it's not a skunk fart, but, but wait. Wait. Pretty good. Pretty good. Um, so, we look at the stats. You can see right out of the gate that our special attack is way higher than our actual attack. That I guess that's probably from our, uh, whatever our nature is. So, that's interesting. Um, and I, I'm going to point this out, too. You'll notice that Kimberly's attack stat is super high. Special attack, a little bit lower. And then Plant, who I put back on the team in favor of uh, Nora. Um, also way higher attack versus special attack, which will come up in a second. Um, otherwise, you can see our attacks really aren't that good. Well, I mean, we have extreme speed, which is extremely awesome. I think the extreme speed is part of why we, why the game, like, gave us Arceus. Because I think when you do that puzzle, when you answer those five questions, if you get it right, like that's when they give you the extreme speed Dratini. They'll always give you a Dratini, but if you get the answers right, then they'll give you the extreme speed one. So I think maybe there was some sort of programming in there that said like the Pokemon you got still had to have extreme speed. Uh, and there's only like 12 Pokemon in the game that can get extreme speed. So I think that's what happened. I don't know. I'm not complaining. This is legit to me. Uh, anyway, natural graph user draws power by uh, to attack by using its held berry. I don't, that seems like pfft, lame. Uh, punishment seems very situational and gravity seems very situational. So really we just have extreme speed. We need different attacks, right? That's a, that is clear to me. And so I think the attack we're gonna start with is uh, none other than, where is it? Dragon Pulse. I know, I know, wait, shouldn't we give that to, uh, Kimberly or plant you might be thinking well you might think that but no because as you can see it's a special attack and uh, Yeah, you know what we got it in the dragon's den uh, This was our Pokemon from the dragon's den and It seems fitting that it should get dragon's pulse as well, right? So we're just gonna get rid of uh, gravity because that seems like the worst um yeah. All right, we've deleted gravity. We have learned Dragon Pulse. It's done. I think it also feels... I, I was sort of trying to decide what item to give um, Ace. We don't have any of the plates, and I don't think you can get them until after we get to Kanto. So we can't change the type. So we could go Silk Scarf and just boost our Extreme Speed's power. power. That's good. We don't have any more leftovers either. So we could go Shell Bell, just get some attack, just get some life back. We could go Amulet Coin, try and get some money. Or I think what I'm going to start with anyway is just the Dragon Fang, because we just gave a Dragon's Pulse. So boost it even further. In a way, it makes us Dragon, um, right? Which is fun, because now, look, hey, the, 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 we're not technically dragon, but we're close. It's like we have three dragons on the team again, and I like that. Now, the other cool thing about Arceus is that it can learn um, every at every attack, right? So we could just go ahead um, and just give it extra stuff, right? We we could just get we could just do it. it could, weirdly, that means it could learn Surf, which I was actually considering because Surf is pretty good move, actually. And uh, then we then we could surf. It would seem weird to give the god of Pokemon an HM move, but surf is pretty good. Uh, and th then we could surf. The problem is that like we'll still. I'm obviously not going to give him Whirlpool and or Waterfall. Those are terrible moves. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna hold off on that. But maybe I think I might do the surf because surf is just good. The question is, what should the fourth attack be? Right? I have Thunder. I have, we can go big, you know, I have Thunder, I have Fire Blast, I have Blizzard, 
It should probably be a special attack of some description, right? Um, I'm trying to decide what is, what are we weakest to? It seems, so we would, ice is a, a weakness of the team in general because we have so many dragon types. Let's see, let's, let's do a quick examination, right? So you're weak to water and like rock and ground and you're weak to rock and ice and you're weak to bug and dark and you're weak to ground and you're weak to like water and ice, right? No, not water, because the dragon, so just ice, right? Yeah, so so ice is, a, is one weakness Ground. Ground is less of a weakness now because Engberg died, so Noel. So Surf then helps cover the ground weakness, pretty solid. And Fire Blast would help s cover the potential ice weakness we have on the team, right? We also have ice himself, but we could switch it to ace. Uh, let's see, Rock is another one. I was using the steel type attacks a lot to get around rock type Pokemon, but that wouldn't be a problem if we just had a water type attack, right? Um, this is, I'm just thinking out loud here. It feels like, it feels like maybe Fire Blast, in which case then Ace just becomes a hilarious Pokemon that has Surf, Fire Blast, Dragon Pole. It feels like the five year, it feels like the Arceus you make when you're an eight year old, but we might just do it anyway. You know what? We can just switch Fire Blast, you can just buy again. So if we get rid of it, no big deal. Um, extreme speed, we're gonna keep. Dragon Pulse, I think we're gonna keep because that was a pretty, uh, you know, rare TM. And Surf, we can just make him forget. So it's really, there's really no consequences here, right? This is reusable. I'm just gonna do it. It's happening. Fire Blast. Yep. Going to Ace. We could also give. We could go fi by Fire Blast to give that to. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of Natural Gift. It's gone. Poof. And learn Fire Blast. And we're gonna, I think we're just gonna go ahead and do Surf too, why not? It's pretty good. Now we have Fire, Water, Normal, yeah. Teach Surf to Pokemon, do it. I don't care. Let's go, Punishment. Yes. Amazing. That's our insane God Pokemon there. All right, now we do have to go do some training though, because the other the other thing you may have noticed is that Ace is a, is a mere level 15, so we're gonna go do a little bit of grinding, and then I guess we're gonna start making our way towards Victory Road. I guess what we should do first is fly back to uh, Newbark Town and pick up ye old Master Ball, as it were. I'm actually gonna, this feels like sometime when you know when Celery might come ambush us with something or something. So I'm just gonna throw Noel in front just so Ace doesn't <laughs> get, to get like slain by Celery. Uh, no, what, no, I, I don't care, Mom. Go away, I didn't mean to talk to you. I want to talk to you, the, the professor. Hi. Oh, Jade, you already collected eight badges? That's so cool. The professor's waiting for you. Yay. Uh, d uh, d hi, Jay. You never cease to amaze me. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of my appreciation. The Master Ball. Excellent. It's the best. That's the ultimate Pokeball. It'll catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to noted Pokemon researchers. I can think... I think you can make much better use of it than I can, Jay. By the way, we just had a group of beautiful kimono girls looking for you. Oh, we have to do the kimono girls. Yikes. Okay. Are waiting for you at the Ecrotique Dance Theater. All right. We should do the kimono girls today, maybe after we grind, right? Okay, so first then I'm going to fly over to... Actually, I think we're going to fly to Ecrotique anyway. Or is it Goldenrod? Where does Morty live? He had the... Trees and other scenery. I think this is the grass I want, Route 37. That was pretty good grass. We're gonna go check that out real quick. This would appear otherwise to be where we need... Yeah, this is where I wanna be. Okay, so we're gonna do some grinding real quick. Uh, hopefully, well, hopefully quick. We're at level 15, so we have quite a ways to go. But, uh... You you will just get to listen to some fun grinding music and I will have to sit here and slog through it. So enjoy the music. I'll be back in a minute.
Oh, okay, grind over. Oh my goodness. I swear, it actually went pretty fast, all things considered, because I only had to focus on one Pokemon instead of grinding like all six of them, but we still had to go from level 15 up to, wait for it, 37. Yeah, and actually we did pick up some pretty good new moves. Uh, let me just run you through it real quick. I didn't go all the way to 39. I didn't think it was necessary because maybe if you look at these stats, you'll notice that um, Ace kind of just started catching up to everyone anyway. Like basically better than plant in every single <laughs> stat, <laughs> despite being two levels lower and like significantly better in many cases there. Uh, there's Rutana, who's uh, who's pretty similar, minus the attack. I mean, you can see that's up to 118. This is up to 105, otherwise all in the 90s. So that's pretty similar. Um, Kimberly has a couple of high 120. The attacks that there just sky high. Kimberly's so dangerous. Magmortar special attack, similarly, so dangerous. But what I wanted to show you here was the attacks we learned. I actually replaced extreme speed. Because uh, you can see our special attack is just so much higher and we replaced it with hyper voice extreme speed was power 80 accuracy 100 and it was a physical attack this is power 90 and a special attack so it's not a priority move but uh we're pretty fast anyway and it's just way better and then we also got earth power instead of fire blast um basically it's just way more accurate and also good coverage for us. So there you go, Hyper Voice, Earth Power, Surf, and Dragon Pulse. Pretty insane setup we have going. We're still holding the Dragon Fang at the moment. That worked out pretty well. The only thing that we ever came up against that gave me anything to be scared about was um, fighting types. So if we see fighting types of any kind, we're just gonna skedads or switch out because uh, that is, that is Kimberly's zone to attack in, am I right? In the meantime, we are gonna head over now to the Kimono Girls and hopefully wreck them. These guys are often pretty hard because you have to fight them five in a row and they have like five, so it's sort of like five level 38 Pokemon in a row. The only real difference is that um, you're gonna have to keep sending out your first Pokemon. So part of me wants to send out Kimberly just to intimidate everything. Uh, that's always, oh, that means you always get the Intimidate no matter what it is. Um, but part of me also likes Noel so we can Toxic whatever it is and then like start up that, that get the Toxic rolling early because they can't switch. Not that the computer ever switches anyway, but they'll only have one Pokemon in. So hopefully we'll be able to handle whatever it is, almost no matter what. Um, obviously no other changes on the team because no one else did any grinding. It was all ace. We got some serious fights in. Oh, everyone, everyone on the team is just like in awe of Ace's like crazy power. Just like, wow, wow. We've we've suffered so much at the hands of Palkia and Dialga. And now like our savior is here. Not that, not that the rest of the team is not, you know, plenty capable. It's not like Ace is coming in and being like, don't worry, I've got this. It's like, it's very much this like, you can do this. It's like such inspiration instilled in everyone, such confidence. You know, if ever there was a unifying factor, it's having, um, a literal god come uh, bless you with his presence. You know what I mean? So um, that's that's been good. Anyway, I think we're gonna lead with Noel because it's it's never wrong. To, oh, 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 celery! Speaking of speak of Dialga and Palkia, how how is this possible? How can I lose to mere kimono girls? Do we have to fight. You are watching me. Yeah, that's right. I never thought defeating five Kimono girls would be so hard. I got beaten to a pulp. You must have come here for the same reason, right? Don't get cocky just because you defeated Team Rocket. These Kimono girls are insanely strong. Go ahead. See if you can defeat them. But I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. Yeah, because you know I'm gonna, right? <laughs> Celery. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. All right. Kimono girls. They normally have each of the five evolutions available for Gen 2, so Espeon and Umbreon, plus Vapora and Flareon and Jolteon. Who knows what they're gonna have? They could have anything. Fortunately, they're not all over level 40, so um, they, yeah, I'm ready to fight. So they won't have, they don't necessarily have all fully evolved stuff, they still could. They can still have crazy high legendary Pokemon. Who's to say? Who's to say? A love disc. Okay, so we're starting not too terribly difficult, I wouldn't say. Um, bop, 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 bop. We don't necessarily, we don't have any grass or electric type attacks on the team though, do we? Either way, we're just gonna play it safe. We're gonna be smart about this, right? We're gonna go to Kimberly, who resists the water. I mean, I guess, yeah, we're not too worried about that. And then we're going to uh, give it the old dragon breath. 
Love disc. Yeah, restores a little. No big deal. Dragon Breath Water Pulse does nothing. Yeah, no confusion on us. Kimberly takes the win. Easy. Well done. Well done, Big Kim. We Kimberly, we win, Burly. You are quite strong. You helped me in Ilex Forest. My name is Naoko. I am the one that's not so good at directions. My eyes witnessed you defeating Team Rocket when Kurt was in trouble at the Slowpoke Well. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Bring it. Slugma. All right. Well, if you say so. Um, we're just gonna go. Oh, we. <laughs> okay. Let's just let's just for fun go into Ace. Let's just show you guys some Ace. Am I right? Lava Plume. Watch us get burned. Oh, that would have been terrible. We're gonna go for the Surf. We're gonna go for the Worf, which is the, the win win Surf. Worf. That's a word, right? We won. Is the point. We surfed. <laughs> so the Love Disc and Slugma. We got lucky out of those first two. Uh, I must thank you for that. Although I'm actually a trainer myself. She who knows the most speaks the least. I am Miki, the kimono girl. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. All right. What you got? What you got? They're all making me nervous. I'm so A Cherum. Okay, so far everything's... Uh, I'm getting nervous. Like we're getting off a little too easy on these guys. Let's bring in um, Ice, literal cannon for an arm. Oh, you want... Oh, you you wanted to you wanted to bring the sunlight against my fire type Pokemon. That just seems dumb when you're a grass type Pokemon. Maybe you wanted to like launch a solar beam or something, but I launched a literal plume of lava at you, and now you're dead. Um, excellent fighting spirit. You got me off the ice by pushing me from the back. Oh yeah, you're the one who wore sandals into an ice cave. Mm -hmm. I was listening to the dragons then when you passed the test of the elder. I love to challenge your Pokemon. Are you gonna have an ice type? Why were you in the cave? What you got? Say a graveler! Oh, it could explode! We don't like that. Um, no, we don't. Let's see. Who has the highest defense? It might just be Noel anyway. Defense 80, 63, 70, 95, and then 95. So it's definitely. Um, Ace or Rutana, predictably. Um, let's see. Ace has the better moves to handle it, so let's switch to Ace. Earthquake, not too concerned about that. Still pretty strong, not gonna lie. We're gonna just give it a surf though. That should pretty much take care of it. Yeah, there you go. Ooh, earthquake, dangerous move, dangerous move. We don't like that one bit. No, we do not. Ah, so close. I almost had you. Yeah. Yeah, it's good to see I want. I feel like I want to feature some ace fights, you know, since we're here. All right, I am the last one. You are so dependable at the Golden Rod Tunnel. I am the one who twirls even underground. I am Cooney the Kimono Girl. I looked at you in wonder when you thwarted Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Allow me to challenge you in your Pokemon. All right, here we go. What's she got? Watch this would be scary now. Now it's the last one. Armando! Okay, so... A um, little bit scary. It, so it's Rock Bug, and we have... Okay, let's see. Rock Bug. So it could potentially have ground-type moves. I don't think it does. I think we're going to go... Uh, let's go for the Toxic. Oh, use Protect. It's sneaky. We're just going to do it again. We're going to go Toxic. Yep, Fury Cutter. Oh, yikes. Uh, so let's go protect ourselves now. It's gonna use protect again. It's gonna use that. Okay, so it's using bug moves. So, well, I think we can just, let's go to Kimberly here to intimidate. No, cause that's rock. We don't wanna do that. Oh. <laughs> Rutana's weak to bug moves. Ice is weak to rock. I, I mean, we're doing okay. Maybe we just stick with Noel, right? Uh, cause it wasn't used in succession, so the Fury Cutter shouldn't have built up, so we can just headbutt and go for a flinch here. Okay, yeah. But it doesn't matter, cause it can't possibly use it in succession, because we'll just keep using Protect. And then maybe we'll get a flinch. Oh. Oh, it got the crit! Like, what is this nonsense? Like, why is it going so high? Fury Cutter, every time they use it, it gets stronger the next time, if they keep hitting. So if you use protect, you just break the chain, no problem. 
um, protect. Quite good. And so effective. I mean, so, so fitting for Noel, who's so protective, you know? And we're not wrong about you. You're indeed worthy of this. Please take it. It's the Tidal Bell. Put the Tidal Bell in the key item's pocket. Mm-hmm. Huh? Who dat? Big sisters! I just saw the big shard of a Pokemon in the World Islands waters. It could be! Che! <sighs> we'll be at the World Islands. See you there. All right. Uh, cool. Bye. All right, well, those guys were um, a little bit... I was, I was afraid they were gonna have something absolutely crazy that we were gonna um, have to deal with. Turns out we did okay. The question is uh, now, mm, we're gonna have to make a We're gonna have to do a thing here. Um, we're gonna have to bench someone because we have to have someone who can like whirlpool and stuff around, which we're gonna, we're gonna give that honor to Nora. The question is who is gonna be off the team? I think it has to be Plant for the moment. Plant, do not take this personally. Not one bit, good, good sir. You will be back for sure. We just, we're gonna have to go do some, some things. It's very, it's very, you know, it's just, we're just gonna heal one more again, just to be sure. We're gonna have to whirlpool and maybe waterfall and stuff. We're gonna, we're gonna we just need Nora to do that because I'm not gonna put whirlpool onto Ace. You know what I mean? Don't want that. Kimberly! Give us the old Flyzilla. Uh, actually, you know what I'm gonna do real quick? I'm gonna go to the Pokemart and buy some repels. Uh, can I buy them here? Super repel. So can I get max repel? I can, cool. Yeah. Because we want to get whatever the, we want to be able to try and catch whatever the Lugia is, right? That would be ideal. So we're just gonna try after the max repel. Where are the Whirl Islands? Are they? Okay. Oh, here. <laughs> Where all the whirlpools are. That makes sense, right? Okay. Um, let's go to Sandwood City. And we're just gonna go here. Did, we didn't catch anything. No, we didn't go in the Whirl Islands. We got something, or we failed to catch something, I think, next to them, Route 41. There we go. Well, that was actually pretty easy to get over here. World Islands, great. Uh, oh, and Flash, oh no. Oh, please say Nora could learn Flash. Please say that. Mm. Nora can learn Flash! <laughs> I did not think that was gonna happen. Okay, so sorry, Nora. Um, I mean, I'm not. I'm not like. Not like. Sorry, sorry. Let's go. Let's get rid of Gust. I don't think you need Gust. Oh, Nora, you turned out to be quite helpful. All right, use your shiny sparkles, Nora, and just give us a flash here. There it is. Bam. Oh, I may. Oh, wait. Hold on. Yikes. We also need to make sure we go ahead and do. Um. Wait, no, where's the... Max Repel, there it is. Yeah. Use the Max Repel, okay. I do not know exactly where to go in this cave, so hopefully it's pretty so intuitive. Scape Rope, okay, that's good. Let's see, okay, not that way. Oh boy, I don't wanna like, oh, Strength? Wait, this isn't gonna work. This is just for coming the other way. I don't wanna move that, because that'll get stuck right there and then we'll be stuck. Okay, so I think actually we needed to go up here and then we need to go over here. Nora, you surf. Ultra Ball, handy. They're like, hey, you might need one of these because there's like a big fight coming up. So just in case, here you go, Whirl Islands. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, what's this? A 
calcium. Gosh, I, I have no idea how you're supposed to do Like I'm so unfamiliar with this puzzle. But like, oh gosh, there comes the alga. Okay, let's um, reset that ladders. The alga's worst enemy. Um, okay, let's see. Oh, and we're outside route 41. So we're outside repels effect wore off. Where do we go? Am I, did I miss something? Did I miss something? Do you have to go somewhere like surf over here now? Uh, I'm okay. Uh, hold on, hold on. Okay, apparently we approached from the wrong side. I think we're gonna go up here back up to Olivine City. Hold on, hold on. Jeez, you guys, I'm sorry. Just bear with me as we do this. I'm gonna buy more repels too because I desperately don't want to run out. I guess you can approach from any side it looks like, but um, seems like maybe the best way to approach is from up here where we ran into the rogue Licky Licky, and now it's just, now we're gonna go straight down. Ah, oh boy. Here we go, we don't really care about this thing, just run. Ah, oh, come on. A dugong. Watch there be another Licky Licky. It's just, oh, we gotta fight someone. Hi, the water's warm here. La loose and limber. Sure, I'll take you on. All right, if you say so, dude. You're kind of getting in the way of my, like, mission to catch a legendary Pokemon. It's not gonna be legendary, is the thing. So, the last time we did this, we went to go fight what would have been Articuno, and the randomizer was set so that all the stat- Oh, a Paris! Um, wouldn't it be hilarious if the, the Lugia was a Paris? That'd be the best. Who's hoping for it? That or a Scyther, am I right? Uh, we all want it. We all want it. Oh, wait. No, I went the wrong way across that. That was dumb. Um, so that we were guaranteed that the static Pokemon would still be legendary, just maybe, just not the legendary it normally is. This is different, so because obviously we're running into legendary Pokemon out in the wild. So the this encounter could just be anything, right? That's the uh, that's the trigger. Okay, so first things first, we're gonna go ahead and max repel it up. Then we're gonna go ahead and have Nora do a quick flash. Thank you, Nora. Use your sparkles. There it is. Okay, lovely. We're gonna go this way. Go there. All right. Uh. Plus, we also have uh, Noel here, just making it more difficult to run into things. Hopefully. Oh, it looks like the flash isn't needed here. Max revive. I think that's. What, I don't know if that's any good. Probably not. Ooh, this guy looks like probably who we want to talk to, right? That, that thing you have. Yeah, oh yeah, that's right. You have found it. Please go ahead. I will go ahead. This looks like we're on the right track, right? What are we doing here? Oh, rare candy. All right, that feels right. You know what? I This, seem, this seems silly, but I'm going to do it anyway. I, we don't really need to use the rare candy, right? What we're going to do is actually give this to Nora... Because, there we go, now Nora is evolving. Oh, look at, I felt like this Nora has done her part. She's used flat, she's our, she's our HM slave, which is, a, which is a bummer, but as a reward, we're giving her the rare candy and now we're evolving our shiny Finneon into our shiny Luminion, oh! Why, why it goes from blue to brown is beyond me, like it could be, Oh, great. Dialga did not like that, which makes me think it's the right it was the right thing to do. Alright, so there we go. We got it. We we evolved our shiny Pokemon. That's fun. And then do we go in here? Is this it? Oh boy, oh boy, World Islands. There's the kimono girls. This feels like the right place. <sighs> Alright, let's see. Izuki, that's right, this is where we welcome Lugia. When the dance we practice many days becomes one with the sound of the title bell we entrusted with you, then Lugia shall come out from deep within the waterfall basin once again. All right, here we go, here we go. Ba, 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 ba. The question is, what will it be? What will it be? I don't even know what level this is gonna be. I did not think about that. Like typically, cause this is gonna be like a level 50 Pokemon, cause if it is, that could be a real problem. It doesn't seem like they would do, well, maybe they would. I don't know. 
I guess they could do that because they did just give you the Master Ball, right? So they're like, yeah, it doesn't really matter what level we make this Pokemon because you could just Master Ball. You don't really have to fight it. So, um, gosh, who knows? Who knows? I'm very nervous now. I did not think this through. Hmm, this was smart. We'll see. You know what? Worst case scenario, whatever it is, we'll just, uh, we'll, we will just Master Ball it, right? Then we'll catch it. This will be our Whirl Island encounter. At the very least, it's almost guaranteed to be a very high level, which is exciting. Um, we don't have any ways to like make it go to, we don't have like really any, um, we can Dragon Breath it, whatever it is. That can potentially paralyze it. Ooh, that's the scariest Parasect I've ever seen. <laughs> Hopefully, who knows, who's to say, right? Oh yeah, there it is, Big Lugia, or is it? We'll find out. Is it there? Oh, okay, <laughs> like, wait, are we glitching again? Uh-oh, Lugia, or not? We'll see what it's gonna be. Um, it's almost certainly not actually Lugia. I don't know if it's going to still be legendary, or if it's um, going to instead, don't you see? It must have been waiting for someone like you all this time. Wouldn't you agree? I would agree. All right, here we go. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. I'm nervous. What? Let's see, maybe we should, I'm gonna lead with um, Kimberly. I guess we do have poison, but we don't wanna use poison because I could kill it. We can, um, Kimberly with your own intimidate, that's nice on whatever it's gonna be. We could also try dragon breath, which will, um, can paralyze it, otherwise we could burn it. That would still kill it though. We don't necessarily want to do that. Um, no one else has any other status moves. Whatever this is going to be, I just feel like it's going to be something safe. Well, safe card could be good. Not really going to matter. Ace, sadly, probably not going to be super helpful because the ace is just nothing but damage. Very, um, you can just protect, I guess. That could be good just to like stall us out some because we've had a problem before where no one has, you have levitate, neither of you have pressure, right? Flame body intimidate. So we can always intimidate cycle if we need to, we can fly. Dragon breath is our best bet to try and get a status on it. Um, we have smoke screens on ice, which is good. We have confuse rays. So we can mess it, we can annoy it for sure, whatever it is. Gosh, I'm, I'm... oh boy. Hopefully we just get first turn dragon breath done. Here we go. Yeah, let's do it. And if it's too scary, it's, it's like, you know, I don't really have any problems losing the Master Ball, right? Because what are we saving it for? Arceus? <laughs> Hilarious. We already have the very best Pokemon in the whole game. So, <laughs> you know, whatever this is, here we go. Come on. Oh, and it's Curlia. Level 45. Level 45 Curlia. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. Uh, that's fun. That's fun. Got the world Curlia's attack. Okay, so... Um, let's see, let's see. My only, so um, Noel's probably the best Pokemon to fight this because Curlia's psychic attacks won't hurt Noel. The only real question is, let's look at the stats real quick. Who has special defense 73, 84, 70, 90. That's pretty good. Nora, and then 97, so. The question is mostly, no, like, if we could paralyze it, that would be great because then we don't really have to worry about, um, hold on, someone has an attack. Is it Earth Power? May lower the target's special defense. I don't know what, why that was making sense to me for a second. It's not, oh, I thought it maybe lowered its special attack which it does not. Okay, so, hmm. We can try and, like, we could try and smoke screen it a lot. My, my question, I don't, I'm very nervous, what I'm very nervous about. The thing is, here's the other thing. We already have Rutan, right? So, Curlia, even if we can get it into, like, Gardevoir, or, um, well, I guess it'll be Gallade. Um, right? Is that right? Is it just, is it male-female for Curlia, for Gardevoir versus Gallade? I don't know. Or maybe it's, like, a move you have? I don't know. Um, my only concern keeping Kimberly in is if we take like a one shot kill from this Curlia, which would have to be like a psychic type attack. Let's go to Noel, because then the psychic type attacks will just absolutely psychic. It doesn't hurt us at all, right? 
Um, let's go for a headbutt. Oh, wow. And it flinched. Okay, so that did a lot of damage right out of the, right away. <sighs> um, I don't think I can even headbutt it again because I think that'll just immediately kill it. Uh, I don't know if we have like a weaker attack. There's the master ball. <laughs> we don't want to do that. Dusk ball. Let's just go for it. Who knows? Maybe we'll get super lucky. We are in a cave, so this should get the four times effectiveness on it. One, two, three. Oh, look at that. Boom. Who remembers the last time when we knocked out that curly up? It's going to be hard not to put curly on the team. That's that was pretty good. If we catch it. If we catch it. That's a big if, right? Throw a quick attack at it. Oh, no! No! We critical hit it with a quick attack! Are you serious? <laughs> what? And now, look at this. Boom. One headbutt, one dusk ball. Curlia on the team. What? That's cool. Not on the team, necessarily, because we already have Rutana. Right, it has psychic power that enables it to distort the space around it to see into the future. What, what, what? Give a nickname to the cock curlia? Uh, yes. Alphonse the curlia. Welcome to the box for now. Uh, that's a very good box Pokemon though. Uh, I think you evolve into Galade with a stone and I'm just did a quick search. It looks like it's not super easy to get said stone until you get to like Mount Silver, which is like the very end of the game. Or uh, you can evolve it into Gardevoir uh, just by leveling it up once. So we'd have a level 46 Gardevoir, which is uh, pretty good, pretty awesome. Although we already have in this in later gens, that would be Psychic Fairy. In this gen, it's just Psychic. And of course, we already have an amazing psychic Pokemon in Mesprit. So I don't think we're gonna be adding Curlia onto the team, but, um, or Gardevoir, but um, very, very solid option for sure. Gardevoir is very good. Um, but there we go. Also, let's take a quick look at, let's take a quick look at, uh, it, it, I, just in case anyone's curious about the stats of our little evolved Nora there. Oh yeah, there you go. Look at that. So, so, so nice, so shiny, so excellent. But you guys, I think this is where we're gonna call it for today. We cleared up the Kimono Girls, we trained up Ace, and we caught the legendary Curlia. Uh, not quite Lugia, but that's okay, because uh, it was still pretty awesome. And we saved that Master Ball. So if we have another crazy legendary first encounter somewhere else, and we have all of Kanto to search for something, we have the Master Ball ready to go, which is exciting. But I think that's where we're gonna call it for today. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to leave a like button if you haven't already and a comment because that is where we come up with the names for newly caught Pokemon. Uh, I check always pretty much the latest episode. So um, keep leaving those comments and maybe, maybe it will be you. Who's to say? Otherwise, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any future episodes of the Nuzlocke. And until next time, bye! Hey, before we go, just want to give a shout out to all of our amazing patrons over on Patreon. Abby, Mondin, Adrian, Shishitano, Afropunk, Annalena, Ort, Brad Johnson, Brianna Bouchard, Cheyenne, Dakota Ballantyne, Dana Guest, Eduardo Bravo, Emerald Phoenix, Gamer Zylia, Gregory Lee, Jacob Rosh, Jade Culture, James Buzanel, Joanna Ashcroft, Karen Choi, The Very Not Lazy, Lacey Nielsen, Lauren Alexandra, Luxpa92, Madison Wolf, Mats Frulis, Momo East, Nicole Cox, Rachel Pierce, Rashiba, Romy Osterheld, Stacy, Yale Ezer, Zane Emerson, and Zero Four Twelve. Thank you all so much for your support on Patreon. If you would like to uh, see your name on the wall of things right here, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. Thanks again. Spork.